I met Quentin Cook through Ike Extensions. His dojo is based in Cambridge, England. And he's done extensive work with the Ike Extensions group, uh, interested in taking Aikido into creating a larger harmony in the world, which is really the essence of the focus of this series. And as such, he put together a book called A Way to Reconcile the World. It's an anthology of many stories from many of the practitioners, some teachers, some students, and others. And I'm really pleased to be able to introduce Quentin Cook to you and his work. I hope you enjoy your time with him. Quentin? Well, I suppose when I started Aikido, I always thought Budo was the way of the warrior, and I assumed that was a warlike path, I suppose. But having been in it for a while, I understand that it's actually exactly the opposite. Um, I think we, we would be wasting our time, and we couldn't make a statement like it's a way to reconcile the world. To let them experience how you can turn violence into something beautiful and that's making a difference to their daily lives and i think it not only makes a difference to their lives but it makes a difference to the people whose lives they touch so you get it out there that way so i'm talking i, I talk to people about you know how they feel themselves and how they can make themselves feel better and through feeling better with themselves they they feel better with the world and other people that they they work with and that to me is, is the beauty of the art really that you've got this martial art you know all about killing people and yet we're talking about peace and love and you'd thought there's a dichotomy there but it's proving that there's not that actually they are sensibly linked and People don't have to be with you for a lifetime to make that change. You know, some people stay on the, on the map for all time, but many, many more do it for a few months or maybe a few years. But I'm pretty sure they take some of what you gave them uh, uh, always if they found it worked. And I think that's, that's an important message. You know, as a teacher, we all want our students to stay with us forever, but we should recognize that we're doing good, even if they're with us for a short time. And when I put together the book, A Way to Reconcile the World, you've got stories from people who've been doing it 40, 50 years, but you've got also stories from people who did it months, and then a situation arose, and it made a, a life-changing difference. So there are lots of powerful, simple little ways in which you can show the power of the principles. And I think... That's how you get it out into the world, because one thing's for absolutely certain, the world won't come to the mat. It's a rarefied few that come to the mat. So we have to leave the mat and take it to them if we really want to make a difference, if it's to be the medicine for the world. Well, I'd have to talk about Ike Extensions, because um, you know, I'm, a, I'm a board member of that, and it's, it's brought me so much rich experience. Um, it's a non-political Aikido group that is interested in allowing Aikidoka to practice together in their different styles and enjoy what we all have to offer, but also um, encouraging people to take Aikido into the world and to share what they know and encourage others to do likewise. Um, so, and it's supporting wonderful projects that make a difference in some problem areas in the world, and we ought to do a lot more of that work. We need to do a lot more of that work. And I'm sure that if the Aikido community actually knew what we were trying to do, I can't see why they wouldn't support it. So 